The ship's ours. The ship's ours. What's up, glitches? And welcome to part two of Colefo's yes. story mode Why? in the yes, Bouncer. This is again the third story mode, the third and final story mode, where the last of the story secrets are revealed, where the last of the big surprises will be shown. And of course, lots and lots of lore, especially in this episode. Trust me. But anyway. Uh, here's Shinra HQ, I mean... Mikado Corporation HQ, and there's our girlfriend. Dominique! Dominique! Yo, drop us off over there. Okay, guy, you can drop us uh, Well, he'd rather die. JK, he away. has a parachute. Volt, you scared him. <laughs> Don't worry, I learned how to drive by playing Crazy Taxi. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Bang! Ah, <laughs> uh, blah blah blah. Congratulations, Job and Mikado, you say? Hmm. Sion's master went missing, and his girlfriend got his old girlfriend, Caldea, got a job at a place called Mikado. You know, this Yo, Mikado. Sure so, hmm, that's, that's concerning. That's very concerning. But what does it mean? We'll find out this episode. Oh God, <laughs> what have they done to their doggos? Seriously, what the heck? It's like, they got their Thanks dogs, they man. cybernetic sure robot-eyed their dogs, Easier said and done. stuck giant spike things to, to their backs for what? Strength enhancement? Tackle ability? I don't, why? What is this tech? What, why would they, or maybe, maybe it's, maybe I'm looking into it too much. Maybe it's not like, maybe they're not like, uh, what the fuck? What's up with that guy? Um, maybe they're not like experimenting on their dogs, Special but force. rather there's a backpack thing on the dog, and because of PS2 graphics, it looks like it's yeah, melded into it. Maybe I don't know. Anyway, we're playing a Sion. Get out of my way! Get out of my way! <laughs> Oh god, the doggos are after me. Oh sweet, Sion's got a double kick. Nice! Sion is the perfect guy to kick dogs. Oh. <gasps> what the, the, the what? 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 A hole? What? What the fuck? Freaking co? What? Why? How? Freaking kill stealer? You got? He just killed. What was that? Was that three or four? He just killed like three or four enemies by himself, which means I got zero of all that XP. I'm not saving here, but if I if I get cheated out of the boss EXP we're about to get, Dominique, if I get cheated out of it, I'm loading the save, We're going back to the ninjas, doing this right. Also, this freaky guy, the guy that stole our girlfriend. I knew he'd be here. It's you. How does it? Feel yes, me, 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 me. You know, the problem with there being so many, with being me, is that there's so many of me. JK, there's only one of me, but there's a lot of ninjas. 
stand a chance. Also, have you heard about our field advantage? <laughs> Shut up, I don't play Magic the Gathering. I was a Yu-Gi-Oh reference. I don't play that either. <laughs> I don't play that either. <laughs> it's jokes on you. Now die. What it takes to save her. Disclaimer, I do play Yu-Gi-Oh. Or at least used to. I played Yu-Gi-Oh and then I kind of just stopped playing it after they introduced uh, synchros. Uh, because I feel that after they invented synchros, they started overcomplicating the game. Like, that's where, like, that's when a bunch of, like, you know, one-turn victories started being a thing. Like, not that there wasn't already one-turn wins, but, like, there was a lot more one-turn wins after synchros were introduced. And, you know, at that point, it made the game not fun to me. Oh my god, he's just freaking ragdolling us. Gotcha! 350 bonus points. Plus a bunch of the XP from taking down those guys. Nice. Uh, attempted to get ground sweep, but I already know it's kind of situational, so nah. More power, though. <laughs> okay. Oh, good, we're not an alier anymore. Now we're a dailier. Nice. Oh boy, I am dreading a mission, a particular mission that's going to come up later. I am dreading a certain mission that's going to come up later. <laughs> going to lose anyone else ever again. Look at Sion trying to be like the fancy schmancy edge boy pr protagonist. This thing's pretty big up close. You have another fall. That's like what? A hundred stories? <laughs> Or at least 50. That's a 50 story drop. <laughs> if we miss. We're not giving up yet. <laughs> I learned this from watching the Predator movies. Which one? One or two? <laughs> oh, uh, from uh, Alien vs. Predator. Wait, that doesn't make <laughs> Wait, that doesn't make sense. There wasn't- The Predators didn't climb anything in that movie. Wait, then where did I learn this from? Sion, don't! And then Sion jumps and falls to his doom. What do you mean an accident? There was an accident in Mikado, and the, what hospital is she in? She didn't make it. <gasps> Chaldea's dead! Well, that's... Well, <laughs> uh, F's in the chat for... <laughs> F's in the comment section for uh, Sion's girlfriend, or ex-girlfriend, Chaldea. Who is definitely not this weird lady that... Uh, also can turn into a black panther for some reason wakanda forever anyway no i'm not running this joke into the ground i don't know what you're talking about wong transfer dominique to the gallios transfer dominique to the gallios gallios hmm what do you mean wong repair center attack the other day Dominique, now possible. I feel like this is a lot of foreshadowing for stuff that's going to happen in, like, part three. Also, this guy's Master Wong. Like, he's the guy that taught, uh, Sion. Also, am I slightly more to the right than usual? Then do you intend to stop me by force, Master Wong? Uh oh. Let's do Old it, man versus young man. Fighting him? Who will win? Master? <gasps> Old man. I learned. I know Kung Fu. I learned this from watching Bruce Lee films. Ugh. In Eastern cultures, they say there's only one way to repay one's master by surpassing him. This is my also, seriously, that punch to the gut looked painful. And not as painful as this. Brick. <laughs> I swear, that's like the most painful looking PS2 -y, like kick I've ever seen. Forgive me. Just freaking shattered his spine. Mikado, Ow. Be stopped. Master. Master, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Master, I'm so sorry I couldn't protect you, even though I barely knew you at all. Oh, and he's all like, hey, oh, you started under Master Wong. No wonder the, no wonder those police guys couldn't take you down. Makes sense. She is my sister. I'm the one who will take her back. Ayo? What? I should thank you for protecting her. Is there any way I can reach The blue girl that's his is his sister? Me for a fool? Ayo? I, guess I have no choice but to fight you then. So be it. I'll you know what they say. The Never send ninjas to do a man's job. Wait, weren't what wasn't weren't, weren't some of the ninjas men? Well. Shut up, I have a chain. You're out of your mind. You don't stand a chance. Also, this is, in my opinion, the first hardest, the first hard fight of the game. Because if you're really, ah, no, 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 no. Back away. Back off. Because if you don't take out. Oh, wow. That was actually really good. Ah, I got it. Oh my god. Wait. Can I? No. No. Okay, no. Get out. Oh, stop. Ah, stop. <laughs> ah. No, he. Oh my god, we're all getting crushed in, in this corner, and it's. Oh my god. I'm. Don't you freaking oh, double boss XP. Oh my. I thought that XP was going to get stolen. That was as perfect as it could have been. Oh my God. Like if we were unlucky, if we were unlucky, like either a he was about to kill us. So either a I would have died or B they would have killed Duragon, the, the, the guy in the purple suit or purple jacket. And they would have taken, they would have wasted that XP. And you know, that's big boss XP, so I don't want to waste it. But no, I defeated the dog, which gave me some XP. And then I comboed it into Duragon. Oh my God, that was perfect. That was. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Torpedo kick is good. I think it... Hold on. I think floating mine is good, too. I think. Floating kick... Float... F horizontal flying back kick using both legs. Maybe? Huh. Okay, you know what? Let's go with health for now. And... <sighs> Do we go with defense or we wait one more? You know what? Let's wait one more. So wait one more, get some more HP or attack power. Either way. Oh, and uh, this section. Next time, you'll see. Try using both First, hands. next time, try using both that hands. Has taught you well. Yeah, because if you don't notice, uh, he said he was going to use a handicap. Apparently, his handicap was that his chain hand, he's not How using. About this? So he only fights you with his left hand. <laughs> and his shoulder. Cheater. It was fun while it lasted, but I have other... It's like, yeah, have you been watching? He's only using his feet and his That's left hand. Dominique. Hey, watch out for the fall. What fall? Oh, God! <laughs> and so we were eaten alive by the building itself. <laughs> Somehow. Ayo. Hey, Here. Uh, insert it? sad music here. Hello, there we go. Darkness, my old friend. Not one moment. Doctor. Doctor. I'm sorry. Hmm. The doctor's on a house call right now. You'll have to find another hospital. Please. Oh, so once again, I still haven't looked it up. I'm pretty sure it's not legal for any hospital to just leave you hanging. So screw these people at their hospital. <laughs> they. They, they deserve their fate. 
not the patients, but the hospital right? people itself. Also, there's Master Wong on the left. Good heavens. To the hospital. Master Good Wong, day. some old man, sir. presumably Duragon, and presumably his sister. Oh, backstory. Sad. Oh god, I'm so edgy. My sad backgrounds my sad background story. Ah, oh, turned away at the hospital. Uh, taken in by Batman. I mean, by billionaire Bruce Wayne. Master I mean, a billionaire. Under one Master Mikado. Yeah, that's it. That's 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 the name. You must become worthy of inheritance. But yeah, basically the story. Yeah, it's like Obviously yeah, as a kid, him and his sister lived on the streets, unknown. The we don't know anything before that. I understand. But uh, his sister got sick. She was gonna die. Hospitals turned her, turned them away for some stupid reason. And Duragon said, Duragon got mad. Uh, luckily, billionaire Bruce Wayne, I mean Mikado, saw them, took them in, treated Dominique, did something to her, uh, before passing away and giving all of the massive multi-billionaire company. And you've to uh, Duragon. Whom anyone would be proud. Your father will rest easy knowing that his legacy lies in good hands. From now on, and there's his backstory. You will lead the Mikado group. So sad. Backstory. Edgy. Crying. I'm too edgy to cry. Also, I have my my Black Panther transforming waifu right next to me. <laughs> Seriously, what the heck's up with that? Also, Wakanda forever. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> this, this single choice right here is probably the most different choice in the game. So, when we played as Volt, all we had to do, we broke, we, they threw Volt in a prison. And Volt basically broke out of prison, broke out of containment, uh, beat up a bunch of people, including a lot of robots, and made his way to a certain room. Uh, Ko, Ko had a really weird one where he got thrown in a locker room for some reason. And uh, he beat up some guards, took their uniform, dressed up as a guard, and pretended and did Simon Says to like pretend to be a security guard and then he made his way to this certain room what did Sion do let's see Chaldea oh so the cries in Chaldea hey watch it oh okay and Sion got, in got into like a bunch of fist fights with people oh Ow, my hand. Okay, so they threw Ko in a locker room. They threw Volt in a proper prison. And they just kind of locked Sion in a room. Wow, that is a pathetic security door. Ow. Luckily, all of the all of the XP here is gonna go straight to Sion and nobody else, cause it's only Sion. I don't even know if we get a heal. Oh, we do. Okay. Uh, health. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let's save. Sion's a glass tank. You know what? Or no, Sion's just glass. Not even a glass tank. Just a glass. Ninjas! Oh, bang! Where's Dominique? Is this job really worth your life? <laughs> she's in there, dude. She's in there, dog. Man, go, go, go! Oh! God, I, I'm pretty damn sure that guy's dead. <laughs> I'm pretty damn sure that security guard is dead. Like, it looks like he snapped his neck. <laughs> but yeah, Sion's, Sion's side mission thing. 
is very interesting because it's kind of like it lets you explore a little bit. Like it's letting me walk around the building just a little bit. Like if you wanted to, you could, you know, stop and smell the roses, look at the paintings on the wall, look at these random things around here. What did it? What door did I just walk into? Oh. Oh, we got a new security guard. We got a big beefy security commander. Oh, wait, wait, but the dots at the top say there's a, a second enemy. Where? Who? There we go! Combo bonus! Yeah, that's how we do it. Also, I'm... I could have sworn there was another move here. Like, Torpedo Kick is good. I could have sworn there was another kick move. Maybe I'm, like, maybe it is the floating. No, Floating Mine is a different thing. Tornado Open Cup is definitely not. It's not these two. Is it Buster, though? No. Wait. Is it? No. It's not a Buster throw. Huh. Anyway, let's go. Let, let's go. Hmm. I'm like, I could have sworn Sion had another move. But I'm just not remembering. <laughs> Maybe they patched it out. It's a PS2 game. How do you patch it out? <laughs> you don't patch a PS2 game. Okay, what's in the what's in door number two? Oh, no. Anybody? Anyone? No. Ah, here's an important looking slightly smaller door. Oh, we're just flat out going to a different floor. Okay. Uh, there's a door. Oh, is that the only door? That's the only door. Okay. What's in here? What's inside door number three? And there's a door there. The heck is this super secret lab looking place? And why does it look like there should be a fight here? Like, look at this. This is perfect for a fight. There should be at least one enemy in here. <laughs> Odd. Uh, elevators. Anything on... Wait, maybe we take an elevator? <laughs> what, do we take an elevator? Or is this just a dead end? Nothing? Wait, is this actually a dead end? Huh. Oh, wow, it is. Huh. Again, you'd think there would be... I don't know. Oh! Okay, there's another one. Okay, you'd think there would be at least, like, one little weak enemy to, you know, fill the... Sp oh, boy! Uh, <laughs> oh! <laughs> that is, uh, that is a lot of guys. That is a... That is a lot of guys. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that was a great combo. I swear, if I don't walk out of this with like at least what 800 XP, then I'm gonna call hacks. There should be at least 800 XP. A thousand three hundred XP! Mamma mia! That's a spicy meatball. If you are Italian, I apologize. I'm not gonna stop, but I apologize. <laughs> Mamma mia, grazie. <laughs> oh, we are going for that attack. Oh, that's as high as the. Wait, that's as high as his attack goes? 200? That's as high as it goes? Huh. Okay. Oh, ne wow, he's already a sailor. He's already a C rank. Huh. 
But yeah, right now, I would say Sion is about on par, if not like one slight step below uh, Volt and Co. <gasps> like Panther! Wakanda forever. Wakanda. Forever? Hey. Okay. Oh great, it's a Sundere Black Panther. Great. The heck am I supposed to do with that? Ooh. Hey, this room looks kind of familiar. Hmm, I feel like we've been in this random room with computer uh, somewhere before, maybe in Volt Kruger's playthrough. Hmm, hmm, hmm. If only I had a perfectly convenient playlist on Game Overlord V's uh, channel to look at specifically Volt Kruger Part 2 of the Bouncer Let's Play. To look up where this lab has been before. Oh, man, if only I had that. Also, I should definitely, you know, maybe possibly leave a like, maybe subscribe, because, you know, I want to see more of this playthrough and future playthroughs. Please, I'd, I'd really appreciate it. Anyway, here's our lore drop. Who? Project M, Special Forces. <clears throat> A project modifying the subject through robotomy surgery. The nervous system has been enhanced to assist in the completion of assigned missions. However, this stimulation of the fighting instincts tends to cause the subject's mind to degrade. Presently, the subject has been assigned as the leader of the Special Forces Unit. Hmm. Well, there's Mugetsu. And yep, this basically, basically they have a taser in his brain that zaps his combat, like, instincts. That makes him go crazy. So he's losing his mind, but he is, like, becoming, but that makes him a better fighter. Freaky. Special Forces Mass Production Type G1. <clears throat> the pre-production version of the mass-produced M-Type. They obey their orders accurately, even while using relatively sh simple and short commands. The primary feature of the G1 is that it utilizes the same system as the M-Type. Testing shows that this unit exhibits almost the same results in the right environment as the M-Type. Presently, these units are assigned as elite members of the Special Forces Unit. Okay, so yeah, this is part of Mugetsu's, like, surgery program. So they're not quite as powerful as him, but they don't go crazy. Special Forces Mass Production Type G2. <clears throat> the, the Type G2 is a lower quality model of the G1. These units are the most economical version of the G series. Presently, these units are assigned to the Special Forces Unit. So when they say economical, what do they mean? That like, what are they doing? Are they renting out? Are they selling ninjas to the highest bidder? Are they like selling? Like this is basically the equivalent of freaking uh, Final Fantasy VII's soldier experiments. If you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, go play Final Fantasy VII, the original. The remake is changes a few things. The remake is technically a sequel to the original, but, you know, play the original. Uh, but, yeah, this is essentially the soldier, the soldier thing. Like, these are first-class soldiers. These are second-class soldiers. These are first-class soldiers. Mechanical, electro engin electrical engineering version 2. <clears throat> Mikado Corporation's original service machine, easily manufactured and possessing a high degree of flexibility. It is one of the many popular products that Mikado produces. This unit is the flagship model for the Mikado Corporation. We intend to develop future machines based on the present popularity and potential of our current machines. Okay, so they have robots. Good to know. The PD series. 
Ooh. Hmm, this guy looks familiar. Hmm. Hmm, if only I've seen the 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 Volt Kruger Colefo playthroughs, maybe this guy would look familiar. Anyway, a project that clone I'm sorry, what? <clears throat> A project that clones a complete human from only a small sample of cells. Oh, wow. Okay, that, okay. By converting the internal organs into machinery, the subject's lifespan is extended to almost infinite proportions. Within the PD series, the unit that made the most innovative difference with the new technology is number four. Once the PD series project is completed, the technology will be transferred for use on Project A2. Biological engineering. Oof. They're committing all kinds of war crimes here. <clears throat> A biological weapon created through bio-experimentation. The main goal is to rapidly enhance the abilities of the experimental subject. The subject is easy to handle and it responds to simple orders sufficiently. We are in the process of expanding our research onto new areas with these results. Okay, so yeah, that's not a dog. That's like an artificially created superhuman dog. Okay. Upon evaluating the unanticipated side effects manifested in PD series, we intend to broaden our research to this example, Chaldea Orchid. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. Chaldea? That sounds very familiar. Also, she looks almost exactly... Like, one of the ladies, uh, like, the girlfriend, uh, what was his name? Rhea. Rhea, I think. From Final Fantasy VIII. Like, look at Final Fantasy VIII, the girl that, the girl in the blue dress. Uh, I think her name was Rhea, I think. Look at her and look at this girl, Chaldea. They are practically one-to-one. -one. Hmm. It's almost like they're made by the same people. Mm, anyway. Uh, broader now research related to cloning. Our best example of this project is Chaldea. The one drawback with our present technology is the treatment ages the subject cells approximately 10 biological years. Huh. Side effects in the PD series. Cloning. Chaldea, 10 years older. Huh. Interesting. Huh. Password is required to access Agelos Anastasius. What? Anastasius. What's this A2, A2 project, and that's Dominique. I need a password? Hey, yo. What? What's going on what here? Fuck? Also, ninjas. <laughs> Ha 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 health. Oh, that is as high as his health goes too. Okay, that's uh, good to know. I guess all we're going for is defense and special moves now. Huh. Okay, so they were doing some shady biological experiments to create their ninjas, their robots, their like weird synthetic humans. And apparently they experimented on both Dominique and on, uh, on Sion's ex. So there's some freaky stuff going on here. Dang you, automated closing doors. Oh, and there's the Black Panther. Wakanda forever. Now we fight. Ow. Oh my god. Ah. It's got the drill kick. Come on, just stay back. 
No! Ah! Well, that was easy. <laughs> 320 XP. Yeah, that was easy. <laughs> Enough to upgrade my defense twice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> you heard it here. Yes, you've seen it and heard it here, folks. Sion Barzad kicks dogs. What? What the fuck? I mean, Panthers. What the? So now it's you. Huh? She looks almost exactly like. Who are you? Dang it, Sion. How do you recognize her? You she looked exactly like her, just slightly older. Huh? She doesn't look that different. Come on, man. Freaking... <laughs> really, Sion? Really? Really? Uh, Sion! Sion! You... You don't recognize her! God... Uh, whatever, whatever, we're just gonna... Fight, but... Glitches, 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 glitches. We we all know who that was, right? Like, it's not just me. It's not just Sion, like, right? We all know that that was clearly Chaldea. We all know that. It's super duper obvious. Also, there's Dominique, and also there's ninjas! <laughs> what? What the oh, fuck? Been, oh, God. Ah, you're choking me. Oh, someone threw a ninja at me. Or at him. Hey, there's Volt. Pay for that. Okay, so we got Volt and Sion here. Stay sharp. Ugh, time to crack our knuckles. There we go. Really, really bad. Eh? Oh, and there's Ko dressed up as a ninja. Nice outfit, Ko. Yeah. The three heroes reunited once again. I don't like you normally, Mugetsu. I don't care if I destroy my mind. As long as I slaughter all of you. God, I love that line. It's so like okay, look, it's actually it's almost equal now. Like, yeah, now his stats are actually pretty decent. In terms of raw power, Siam is the hardest hitting member now. It's because you know what it is? It's because we bought, you know, we bought like two moves for Volt. We bought two, like two or three moves for Ko. We didn't buy any moves for Sion. We, we've only bought one move for Sion. <laughs> so like, that's why I was able to invest all the points into stats. Okay, we got an army of ninjas and Mugetsu. Let's do it. I got it. We got to! No! Back off! Oh wow, Sion is packing a punch now! Stop it, Mugetsu! Leave me alone! Wonder, could you potentially combo like taking out a couple of enemies and then take out the boss like imagine getting a times eight multiplier and killing the boss it would be risky as all hell because they the NPCs might kill it gotcha Oh, that was so close. See, Volt almost killed him. <laughs> Volt almost killed him. Okay, now the question is... <sighs> this next mission is going to give us a lot of XP. This next mission is going to give us a lot of XP. Do I go for defense? To try and max out my, my ability to block? Or... Do I save up for a double knuckle or a hurricane blitz? I could theoretically get a hurricane blitz by like the close to final boss. Maybe. <sighs> Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. We're going for the hurricane blitz.
But we're also coming up to the hardest mission in the game, in my opinion. Dominique. Oh yeah, it's time for a nice romantic moment. Dominique. Come on, Dominique. <laughs> come on, Sleeping Beauty. Come on, Prince. You know, it just occurred to me. It just occurred to me. Yeah. We don't see many characters in like anime that are like pretty and have like the little tiny, you know, birthmark things, like birthmarks on their face. Uh, outside of like <laughs> milfs, <laughs> outside of like you know. Milf, ter milf characters. Don't mean to outside of like older female characters, we don't. Later. Outside of like older female characters, we don't really see birthmarks in anime, do we? Let's get going. Great. Now that I think about it, it's like yeah, it's like huh. I'm like huh. She looks pretty. She has a little cute birthmark. Sounds good to me. But like, wait a minute. Let's move. I'm like, have I, I, I'm like, wait, have I ever seen any other female character with a, like a beauty mark? There are intruders in the rocket tower. Ever? In, le, that's phone. young. That's considered young. Damn. Like, it's always like the older characters or like the bar owner lady. It's never like the young girl that's like under 20. No, that's not what I meant. Hmm. What I'm saying is we need a I have to do my research. I mean, what? Anyway. <clears throat> I didn't say anything, sus. I didn't say anything. No, shush. No. No Amoogus. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, this is the hardest mission in the game, and it's up now. Whoever we don't pick is going to go and act as a distraction, while who we do pick has to act on guard duty and fight an army of robots. Let's do it. I'll go Aww. there. Thanks, Sion. So we're the decoys then? <laughs> Don't sound so disappointed, Ko. <laughs> I love this game. I love this game so much. <laughs> Honestly, I'll probably play it one more time off screen just for the fun of it. <laughs> Damn. Come on, Ko. Okay, let's go. Be careful, you two. Don't worry, they've got this. With his triple kick and Volt's frigging health and power. Close to me. Man, they, okay. they, you don't worry about them. They, they got this. <laughs> oh boy. Well, let's go. Ow. Really? But yeah, look at this. His his little ow. Ah! Oh my god. That damage. What the heck, man? Oh my god. What is up with these robots right now? It's so aggressive. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? You know what? I've already accepted it. We're gonna die. There's no way we're making it through this now. You know what? Just, you know, just, you know what? No, there's no way we're making it through there. There is no way we're making it through there. There was absolutely no way we're making it on that HP. No way. <laughs> We're just gonna skip to it because there is no way in hell I'm beating that mission with that HP. Skip. Uh, Sion getting into fights. Sion. Cute hug. Talk about girls with moles. Beauty marks, whatever you want to call it. It's a mole. You just call it beauty mark because it sounds nicer. No! Oh. 
No, no, no. Oh God. No, bad. Robot, bad, bad. Kick, 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 and. Oh, okay, good, 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 good. It's like, it's so weird. It's like, I think it's a weird thing where it's like, if you're slight, if you move slightly to the left or right, they're like the, the time it takes for them to slightly adjust to that angle. Like slows down their reaction time. It's like, if I keep attacking from the front, they get super aggressive. But if I attack from like, an angle and I start moving at an angle they have to spend the time turning which in turn leaves them wide open it's very weird it's like if I just stood here and kept doing punch punch kick they're gonna get aggressive but if I do punch punch kick and I'm like slightly moving to the left or right then it changes everything like look I'm holding down left so I'm like slightly moving to the down left with the kick. But it's like so unnoticeable that like it's hard to notice. Like right now I'm holding right down. So I'm slightly moving to the right and that's wasting its time. There we go. Versus if I just did it without moving the analog stick at all. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, hey, a security guard. Man, I was, man, I haven't seen one of you guys since the frigging tutorial area. Oh, man, what have you guys been up to? Uh, dying, I see. Okay. Okay, so we could go the other way and fight some enemies. We're not going to, because screw this place. We don't need to waste our time with more robots. If you fight every single enemy here, I think it's like a thousand five hundred XP. Even more if you combo it. So that's cool. So yeah, there's two more robots on the upper level. I think they're a small one, a big one. But we can just kind of ignore that. We don't need to. You know, you could ignore most of these enemies if you really wanted to. You could actually run past all of them. Like, see those two over there? I'm pretty sure we can ignore them. Moving to the right, moving to the right, moving to the right. Moving to the left, moving to the left, moving to the left. And you're dead. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun dun. Burp, burp, burp. Ow! My god! <laughs> it freaking comboed me. Come on. Come on. Die. 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 Ah. Come on. Move slightly to the right. Move slightly to the right. <laughs> Slide to the Ah. Everybody kick their feet. Ah. Oh, God. Nope. Okay, you caught me off guard there, and I am not going to be reckless again. Bottom right, bottom right, bottom right, bottom right. Killed a little one. <laughs> that sounds wrong, out of context. Bottom right, bottom right, bottom right, bottom right. No! Oh, okay. Starting to reach, uh, starting to reach dangerous levels of HP. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ah, uh, slightly nervous. Ah, oh, God! 
slide to the right. Crisscross. <laughs> okay. Woo. Okay, and look, if we slightly turn to the right, like right now we turn the camera slightly to the right, you might be able to see them on the left, right, maybe? Nope, you can't. Okay. Well, on the right over there, like where that yellow fence is over there in the distance on the right hand side, right under the health meters, uh, you'll notice there's two more enemies and they're two, the both of them are over there. We're not going to fight them because screw that. <laughs> 1,800 XP. Ooh, 3,336. We are getting that hurricane blitz. Or, hold on. Yeah. And we're going to go for defense. But hey, if we can get another move, I think I'm going to go for either the floating mine. Yeah, I think I'm going to go for the floating mine next, if we have enough. B rank. Woo. Sion is now officially the strongest character of the group, technically. In terms of, like, objective ability. But, if you want to see what's going to happen next, what's going to happen after fighting all those robots, because we're about to hit the finale, the end game. And things are going to go crazy. Reveals are going to be revealing. Secrets are going to be secrets. And jiggles are going to be jiggles. I mean, what? Who said that? Anyway, it could not. What? Who? Uh, what? Anyway. <clears throat> Anyway, 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 uh, if you want to see what's going to happen next, please like, please subscribe, tune into the next episode. Shit's going to hit the fan. It's going to be great. We're going to see the finale and we're going to see what happens at the end on the third playthrough. It's going to be great. <laughs> I'm going to die a lot. Anyway, I'll see you around, glitches. See you in the finale of the Sion playthrough of The Bouncer. Please leave a like. Please subscribe. Check the links in the description below for my Twitter, TikTok, etc., etc. Friday Night Funkin. I'd really, really appreciate it. It really, really would make a... You know, especially the like, actually, at this time, just boost the algorithm. For this playthrough especially, like, it's... I want this playthrough to reach people. Anyway, I'll see you around, glitches. Bye-bye! Robots. <laughs> Freaking robots.